Hello friends, today we operate thermo motor using a tiny microcontroller. Now we start the project. First we open Tinkercad. This is a Tinkercad dashboard. Now we search supply. First we have to take supply. Then search a tiny. This is a tiny. Now we search breadboard. Take one mini breadboard, small breadboard, and use the A tiny on the breadboard. Now we search potentiometer. Take two potentiometer. We have to operate two servo motor. Take two potentiometer and search servo motor. And take two servo motor. Try again, drop here. One. Another I have to take second. Now we connect the circuit. First, we give the power supply to the breadboard. Positive terminal connect to the boxing. This is a positive terminal. And now second terminal is a negative. Then connect to negative terminal to the negative of the breadboard. This is a negative. And bypass the current to the to here also. We have to connect. And positive terminal connect to the positive of the breadboard. Now connect the A tiny. In the fourth pin is a ground pin. Connect to the ground. And eight pin connect to the power. This is power pin connect to the power. Also change the color black. Again, now connect to the potentiometer. In the potentiometer, we have to connect the positive and negative to the potentiometer. There is three pin. One pin is terminal one. Second is wiper, and third is terminal two. Any terminal connect to positive, and second terminal connect to third terminal connect to oh, negative. Second terminal connect to positive. And wiper pin connect to the microcontroller pin number PB4. You have to use PB4. Connect to the first potentiometer. PB4. Also change the color. Then it is yellow. Now first potentiometer is connected. Now we connect the second potentiometer. Any terminal connect to the positive. I have connect to the negative terminal. And second potentiometer connect to the second terminal of the potentiometer connect to the positive terminal. And wiper pin connect to the PB3. Where is PB3? This is the PB3 connect to the second potentiometer. Also change the color. Guys, the put green. Potentiometer also connected same direction. Now we connect the servo motor. Positive terminal connect to the positive. Positive. This is the ground terminal. Connect to the ground, to the breadboard, and positive terminal. Connect to the positive to the breadboard. Also put the color black, red. And in the second servo motor, also positive pin connect to the power pin. Connect to the power, and change the color black. And negative ground terminal connect to the ground of the Arduino. I have connected the ground. Now we connect the signal pin. Signal pin connect to the PB zero, PB one, and this is a PB two. Signal pin connect to the PB zero. This is the PB zero. I have connected, and second servo motor connect to the PB one. This is the PB one. You can see this is the PB one. Now circuit is completed. You have to put the code. Click on the code section. This is the code section. And click on the block. Click on the text. Continue. Delete this code 
and save the code here. This code also given in description. You can download the code and paste it here. Now we start the project. First we start simulate, and now rotate the potentiometer. You can see thermal motor is rotating when we rotate the potentiometer. You can see. So if you rotate the potentiometer, servo will operate using a tiny microcontroller. If you have any problem, comment also. Thank you, all friends.